Sniper. It's a big one. It's a big one. That's a rock. Friends, today I'm on a trip to a big river called the Potomac. I brought the canoe on my car and fishing gear in the back. I'm going to use my hummingbird fish finder because the river can be pretty deep in some parts. So come with me on this adventure and let's see if we can catch some fish. Hey folks, I'm out on the Potomac. It's a little windier but there is cloud cover, so I'll get some protection from the sun. Always remember to put some suntan lotion. Protect yourself if you're in the water for extended periods of time. I've always wondered how deep Potomac is, at least in this upper area. Let's find out. This is kind of the shallows right now, but later I'll go to the middle and see how deep that is right now it's 11 feet 11 12 feet 77 degrees nice calm in this cove thanks for joining me everybody hey if you're joining me for the first time please consider subscribing and let's see if we can catch something today not marking any fish yet on the Hummingbird. Just gotta wake up the fish. It's nice and early on a Sunday morning. Well, if I'm not getting any bass today, I was hoping to dedicate the first hour to try to catch some bass if they were out here, but I think I'll just target blues. I know, the catfish want to play. There's one big fish right there, almost 60 feet deep, halfway down the water column. This is the setup I'm doing. Six inch Berkeley gull. And I have a ring on it to keep it on a little longer because these fish fight. Something that's biting. Mmm. Uh, let's see. What are you? Coming up. Oh, it just lost my worm. You owe me some money. Someone there young too. Sleek. Put up a good fight. One I can hold like this. That's a little better. Alright, good way to start the day. Yes. It's a small one. How much you weigh? I'm sorry. I'll let you go in a second. Let's see. You are three pounds. Great way to start. Just measure your quickly before I let you go. With the pincers.
Now that we caught that guy in nine feet in the shallows, it's a small one. Let's try for a bigger one. I'm gonna use my hummingbird and let's see how big of a catfish I can get today. So let it drop. It's gonna take a little bit of time to get down there. There's a lot of action down there. I should be able to catch a blue. At 57 feet. Um, I think uh, something's on here. <laughs> Make sure it's in the mouth. Deep, deep, yes. Yeah, it's on there still. I'm gonna set up. Yeah. Doesn't feel too, too big, I think. Oh, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> it's funny, they don't know that they're hooked until moments later. Oh, this is a good one, folks. Love these blues. Awesome fighters. <laughs> uh, it's coming up slowly. Slowly. This one, like, oh! Yeah, you really didn't expect that you were that close. Check it out. It's a belted kingfisher, perched way up high. Although small, this predatory bird is very good at diving for fish. out further and further so it's harder to get right on target above the fish when I'm that deep so it's kind of hit or miss if the fish will see it or not see there's one right there on the flats oh wait oh my god <laughs>
This is nice enough to slow down for a moment. Oh god. Please don't fall off. This feels pretty nice. <laughs> yeah. Oh. It's like a shark from above. How do I get it in? This one feels heavy. <laughs> Let it tire out a little bit. Oh, the mouth is huge. <sighs> yeah. I got a, I think I got a bulga grip it. My net is not quite big enough. Uh. Oh, that mouth is huge. Look at that, folks. Oh, man. Caught in the middle depths of the water. Oh. Oh, <laughs> oh folks. Look at this. I don't know how am I going to measure this one. Oh, let me let it breathe for a second. stuff in the boat right now. I'm making a makeshift holder here for the catfish to be still be in the water so it doesn't fall off and I can paddle somewhere and maybe I can land it along the shore. Let's see. That's the fish knocking around. Six and a half inches. One last thing is the weight. Seven and a quarter pounds. But isn't that beautiful? Biggest. Turn it around like a rotisserie. You're so slippery. Slimy. Look at their mouths. That fat mouth. It's a beauty. Let's see if I can release it now. Thanks for joining me as I sought some blue catfish and found them in pretty deep water with the help of my hummingbird fish finder. One of them being my personal best at seven pounds. Rocks. Nice bird, dead ahead. Please subscribe if you're new here and like if you enjoyed my video. Comments and questions are always welcome. And press the bell button so you don't miss a thing. And I'll bring you more fun adventures. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time on my outdoor, nature, and fishing channel. Wake! Surf's up, dude! are out and about enjoying the warm weather. Can you guess how many turtles will end up on this log?
The answer is four. Four turtles. If you guessed right, pat yourself on the back.